crop is usually propagated vegetatively by the use of cane cuttings or bird chips. The cuttings can be planted directly to the main seedbed while the buds are raised on a nursery at a spacing of 15 cm by 10 cm prior to transplanting to the main field. Vile hii miwa ilivyo, ikifika miezi tisa, itakuwa imefika kukatwa na kusupply kwa wengine. Na ikiwa haita ita supplyiwa kwa wengine, inakuwa miwa ikiruka miezi kume na mbili, tayari itakuwa ya sukari. So kuna stages ikifika, ni lazima iwe ya sukari. Na stages zingine ikifika, ukitaka mbegu uneza itoa hapa. Kwa hivyo kwa vile sina maale pengine pa kuenda kulima, hii nitaiwacha iwe eh, sukari. Land is normally cleared first, plowed and then replowed again before harrowing. Cuttings from the young cane plants 12 to 15 months and then planted. Buds from the young cuttings began to sprout in few days to form a new stalk. The plants are regularly weeded and gapping is done in initial stages. Later, very little work is done on the farms as the crops grow. Miwa yoyote ineza vunwa ikapewa kama mbegu. Bora weke dawa inayo istai mili labda mchua na nini. Lakini pia miwa yoyote ineza fanywa kama mbegu. E, kwa sababu kivuna vile ilivi yamefika miezi tisa, uneza peleka watu wa agri kachaweke dawa yao na wana kuuzia wengine ikiwa kuna mtu labda atataka. Lakini kwa mimi vile ni juavyo, Yangu likuwa nimeiweka kwa madhumu ni ya e, e, sukari. E, kuna mbolea kupanda, e, urea, na kuna DAP. So DAP ndi unaweka chini, unaweka miwa. Ikisha toka vile ilivyo, ikifika miezi saba, tunaweka e, urea ili yende araka. Kama hii, zi utengezwa kwanza ndi upande. Yeah. So, hakuna ingina, lesu untaka dawa ya kufura, nyasi kauke lakini mara mingi sisi uamini ukilima ndani vile wanalima hivi inatusaidia kuliko labda kuweka hizi madawa ambazo wengine zinaweza atuharibia mashamba sisi tunaamini hivyo ili tukipanda mahindi isiwe kama hii hata baada ya kuacha kilimo ya, ya miwa eh. Jonathan Murombi the harvesting superintendent at Transmara Sugar Company explains more on the care and management of the sugarcane crop while on the farm Kwa kufikia hiyo stage ya 4-5 months, miwa yako itakuwa imeshikana in a form canopy. So, ina suppress weeds completely. Akutakuwa na nafasi tena ya weeds kumea na inasumbua mkulima. Okay, from there, kasi yako itakuwa mibi ni kununua dawa, kama roundup, ama one of the, one of the, nini, one of the dawa zambazo inasatusaidia kuwa hizo kwekwe, inasatusaidia selective, ama non-selective, sa hizo madawa. Alafu unapiga around, all, all round, ili iwe safi so that that ukifanya ukija kufanya fill survey yako kuna penye unaweza kupita pavement nzuri na pia hiyo miwa inaweza pata oxygen hiyo mambo na kupumua miwa inakuwa na afya nzuri okay kuna method pia ambayo inaitwa the trash alignment trash alignment now comes in you count like five lines you align the trash along the the ridge hiyo pia iko na disadvantages na advantages because uki align it means umetoa trash zote umepanga kwa hiyo malaini no one expose miwa na hiyo area mwenye miwa iko imekuwa exposed to the sun the fireball weeds will now shoot because imepata mwangasa ikisha shoot itakupea kasi ya kupalia more than twice or three days till miwa ikuje fanya nini ishikane form canopy alafu tuko na method pia ambayo wakulima huwa wana they do away with trash maybe by burning or maybe by taking away mpaka maybe at the edges of the field hiyo ndio the worst method because one I see what you call the soleration. Alafu, kuna pia eh, wakisha choma. Wana choma the importance of the beneficial microorganisms. Wana choma hizo. Na hizo ndiyo inatusaidia kutengeneza mbolea. The humans and also to decompose the nutrients equate in, the, in that stage whereby can be taken easily by the, the roots of the, the cane. So, uwa hiyo tunai discourage. Na ndiyata kwa hii region, tunai discourage hiyo kabisa ingawaje. Uh, wakulima, we, we usually call them innovators. Some of them find this method, the new method, as so much difficult. But once it can work from the neighbor, wakirusha macho waone hiyo miwa ya neighbor ikonzuri, 
pia wanakuwa impressed na wanafanya nini wana encourage hiyo method because hata size to same the guy shamba katikati tufanye trash alignment tuchame the other side hii miwa yenye tume trash tume trash blanket iko na afya na itakuja mbio sana because iko na nutrients na iko moist so hiyo ndio disadvantage na advantage ila itakuwa moist jua ikija kwa mfano jua ama mfua ina sweep nutrients ziko top again jua ikipiga inaua zile microorganism na tena ina this ina nini ina, ina catalyze the germination of the weeds there are six sugarcane varieties that stand out for further features which include higher cane sugar yield early maturity low fiber and tolerance to drought and major diseases such as the stout and mosaic the varieties include the Ken 82216, Ken 82219, Ken 82247, Ken 82401, Ken 82808 and Ken 83737. Farmers in Kakamega County are planting an improved cane variety that has been imported from South Africa. Hii ni mbegu tuliletewa kutoka South Africa. E, inaitwa kangumu so sielewi zaidi ya hapo unajua pia mimi si mtaalamu e, sisi ni watu wa kupewa tu na kupanda so e, si kama ya ukambani na wala si kama ya kisi kwa sababu hiyo type ya miwa ya kisi hipo sisi tunailima lakini ni karibu na mtoni e, hiyo ni special tu kazi yake ni kuliwa we have different varieties kuna varieties ambazo zina tassel mapema yani zinatoa feature kama maingi kuna varieties kama Uh, CO945 kuna CO421 hiyo tunaita manyule kwa lugha yetu ya local na kuna variety kama Kenite 2601 ambayo ni scale down variety from the CO421 hiyo manyule huwa ikifika maturity inaweza kutasol ama inaweza kutoa feature pia kuna factors ambazo zinasafanya itasol maybe utunzi wa hiyo miwa haikutunza vizuri What we find in a lot of parts of Africa is that most of your sugarcane varieties have been developed outside of your country of, of operations. Um, so you find a lot of cane varieties were developed maybe in South Africa, Mauritius, Reunion Island, India. Um, and what we're trying to do at Transmara is we've started engaging with the Sugar Research Institute of Kenya. Um, we understand the restrictions they have in terms of financial strength to be able to adopt an aggressive development program but it's very important that we work very closely with all authorities um, and what we're doing in, in Transmara is we have set up variety trials in various locations in our different climatic zones um, so that we can do an evaluation of the different varieties in terms of yield and sucrose development for for extraction in the factory um, we are also introducing new varieties that we're working closely with the sri on uh, specifically from um, reunion island um, so at the moment we've probably got a handful of about four or five varieties two of which are quite entrenched um, like co421 uh, they refer to as manuela um, because of the smut whip which is not a good thing it's it's a it's something that we're trying to reduce Uh, varieties like D8484, CO945, we have N14 um, and some of these varieties are known as early or late maturing but when you've never done research specifically to your area you're not quite sure on the characteristics so that is why we've introduced the variety trials we have our own agronomy department we have an agronomist um, who has his masters in agronomy and then we have a very strong technical team from Mauritius that supports our research here. Um, we've installed a hot water treatment plant to start developing certified um, nurseries. Um, so, so we're being very proactive to find solutions, not only for the short term, but for the long term development of the region. Apart from sugarcane farming being costly, the other challenge that farmers face is the cost of farm inputs such as fertilizers and manure that is required to get a healthy crop. E, zipo changamoto kwamba mfano kampuni yetu vile ilivyokuwa kulikuwa na watu walagai. Saa zingine ukipata tani 20 wengine wanakata. E, wanakupa tani 12. So hiyo ni baadhi ya changamoto na malipo na DR kuna kitu tunaita DR sielewi kwa Kiswahili inaitwaje lakini sisi tunaita hivyo. 
unapeleka miwa labda mfano mwenyewe ulifanyia kazi vile sisi tumefanya hivi alafu ukifika huko tena wanakuwekea ma, 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 maneno ya kusema eti haujafanya nini auja wanakukata hizo pesa sasa mpaka unabidi unadaiwa so kidogo tunaweza tumia neno ufisadi katika makampuni e, pia iko inachangia so hizo ndio changamoto ambazo tuko nazo e, lakini naomba serikali e, ingilie kati kwa sababu sisi wote plus viwanda tuko chini ya serikali so ukinyanyasa hata kama asifanyi kwa serikali serikali ina haki pia ya kuchunguza mambo kama hayo kwa hivyo hizo ndio changamoto tuko nazo uh, the county government has had efforts uh, to try and see how to come in and help particularly Mumia Sugar Company which has actually been holding a big stake in cane farming in uh, western Kenya but uh, this is not the first time the county government is showing interest or uh, coming out openly now to say it's now time for us to help the, the farmers. Actually, when we talk about reviving mumias, our focus is on the farmers. So the efforts that have been there before were kind of uh, not successful because of the prevailing pol politics then. And I think we lost the focus. Uh, the focus was not on the mill. The focus was more on the issues of politics. And the two, of course, could not merge because the county government was also taking root. And because of the the, the concern and the, 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 the interest that the county government had, of course, through the leadership of His Excellency, the governor of Kakamega, which is a weekly from of Paranya, he took his initiative actually to convince both the legislative arm to ensure that we help the farmers by helping them to pay even part of uh, what was in form of arrears by them. But because of what is happening at that time, that was not successful. And there were a number of issues that came up. And you know, these are appropriated funds which have to be accounted for. You, county government also doesn't do business. It's supposed also to find a way of, uh, we are not investing to get profit. We are supposed to help the wananchi Because that's actually our core uh, business and calling. And because of what was prevailing at that time, the whole program stopped. Now, this time round, uh, or when that stopped, uh, nothing good has been forthcoming uh, from, the, from the, both the company and even from the farmers. And if you remember recently, His Excellency, the governor of Kakamega, when he was appointed by the, the president uh, to co-chair the, 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 the sugar, National Sugar Task Force, you remember the immediate result everybody has been able to appreciate. Because, uh, because of that, and because of the keen interest they had uh, in, the, in, the, in the factory and the farmers, I think we've been able to see farmers now being paid because of the long outstanding arrears that were there. I know that not all of them have been paid fully. There's just a small fraction remaining, but at least we appreciate what has happened. But now, as a, gov as a, as a, as a, as a, as a government, we, you know we cannot stop there. Vile miwa ilikuja. Nafikiri eh, imetusaidia sana mimi personally na wenzangu wa kulima. Nikiwa mfanyikazi pia mimi pia ni mkulima. Lakini community yetu hii ya Masai ni community nzuri sana so hapa Transmara. Ni watu ambao wakiona kitu ambayo mimi naweza kuwa benefit in the future, they impress that that thing. Wanaikaribisha, wanaipenda na wana, wanafanya kwa nguvu. Naona kabisa vile imepangwa ni Imepangwa ile steak ya kutosha, imepimwa futi yake, imepimwa hai. We visited Mze John Kotum Olenengire's farm where sugar cane was being harvested. He told us that his cane took more than 12 months to mature. Wakati hii mashini ilikuja transmara, mimi nikalima shamba. Hakini nilikuja nikayacha. Kwa sababu, Shamba ama miwa inahitaji pesa. Na wakatu huu watu kukua na pesa. Na watu kukua na msaada yoyote tunapatiwa na kampuni. Ilikuwa tu unalimwa mwenyewe kila kitu. Unaletewa tu miwa. Alafu unapanda peke yako, unapalilia. Hiyo sasa ikaja, ikatulemea. Atu kuendelea. 
ama mimi si kuendelea kwa sababu ya ukosefu ya pesa niwa kiwa na pesa ah pesa utapata unajua kawaida wanasema pesa inaenda kwa pesa kwa hivyo kama tungekuwa na pesa hapo mbeleni tungekuwa mbali saa hii lakini tunatarajia tu tutakuja kufaulu tena unaona vile miwa iko imepangwa vizuri na ni miwa mzuri sana hapa transmara miwa eh unaona vile iko yusi nilikuwa upande ya kakamega nikaona miwa kidogo 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 lakini unaona kama hii eh sasa unaona kama hii miwa ya maana sana kubwa eh